so here we are doing a little selfie interview just uh, 10 15 minutes from the start how, yeah. are, you, how are you feeling well uh, let me put it this way this is uh, the first mountain bike race I've done in 17 years and uh, only my second one so I'm uh, standing here with a few butterflies in my stomach but I'm sure it's gonna be a lot of fun and uh, this first stage both you and me have said that uh, <laughs> we're gonna try to take it quite easy and uh, not kill ourselves uh, Let's, what's our motto for this trip our motto for this uh, trip and for Cape Epic is survive stay alive and that's a good motto I think yeah and and you can actually add to that not crash well, that sort of goes with uh, stay alive. <laughs> so, yeah, it's uh, it's a lot warmer than we thought today. Uh, we uh, shed all our uh, uh, sort of wind protection gear. All our warm arm warmers are off. So, yeah, it's going to be hot. It's going to be real hot. It's going to be good. It's going to be nice. So, better uh, for sure. Uh, a lot better having this weather than uh, four degrees in rain. In this first climb of the day, 600 height meters to go. Jonas feeling fresh as always. Big smile, big smile, big strong. This is a lot of fun. Sure, it's different from triathlon. And I'm keep telling him, take it easy, take it easy. Yeah, so I'm, I'm the fat guy now. I have a lot of things to learn going down. My technique really sucks. I know that. But uh, I think for every downhill, my technique improved somewhat. Uh, and going uphill was, uh, was a lot of fun, but it was hard. So uh, we were out there a lot longer than I had anticipated. I think maybe our start was unnecessarily slow. We were way, way, way back uh, at the gates, so to speak. So uh, we had to wait for quite some time, but that's that's okay we can uh, improve from this stage on so uh, it's uh, it's fun to do my first mountain bike uh, race it's a great experience I think Jonas did a great race today uh, he had some uh, steep learning curve uh, going uh, downhill, but uh, of course uh, he used his strength going uphill. Uh, he has some uh, really nice cardio, uh, of course, and uh, I couldn't keep up with him. So I think uh, we're going to be better uh, each day uh, coming into this race. First day, uh, the scenery was great. Uh, I think we, we really enjoyed the hot weather. What I found really hard with, uh, with the course and what I'm sorely unfamiliar with is uh, riding down in really steep and technical terrain. Like there's a lot of, uh, lot of rocks uh, that almost uh, form footsteps coming down or sharp rocks uh, sticking up from the ground. So I find that very, very hard and quite intimidating. So it's a matter of uh, keeping the speed down if possible because it's pretty tricky to uh, ride with the brakes on as well going down so it's uh, it's uh, sure it's a challenge and it's different from triathlon and it's different from being on a road bike and uh, there's a lot of shifting going on all the time a lot of levers with the with the uh, suspension and the, the course changes uh, so rapidly so all of a sudden you find yourself stuck in the wrong gear and with the suspension on when you should have it off and so but it's all good fun the, the scenery was beautiful and that's the uh, main attraction of being on a mountain bike you uh, basically see the same things you would do on a cross-country run but uh, on a mountain bike you cover three times as much ground as you would have running so that's uh, that's the best thing with this race I think high five Yep, we're in 430. 
it's pretty pretty decent day. <laughs> It was a lot more technical than I expected actually. It was, uh, it was pretty rough out there uh, on the, some of the descents, but I have a steep learning curve right now, so uh, what doesn't kill me makes me stronger, I guess. But uh, it's a thin line, that's for sure.